All right, guys, we're going to be going over how to actually protect your portfolios during the next market crash or just in the bear market. Right now, the market's looking pretty bearish. As you can see, I am down um, a little bit on my portfolio, uh, but not too worried. It's just uh, temporarily for the short term. Uh, but we're going to be going over some methods, how to protect your portfolio and what you should do to hedge against a market crash or just a bear market in general. So the first method is simply just buying the what's known as the fear index, the VXX. Um, this is an ETF basically that inverses the S&P 500. So when the market goes up, this ETF goes down and vice versa. When SPY goes down, this ETF goes up. So it did pretty well during the so pandemic, the crash and back in March, as you can see here, going from 50 to 200. Um, so, yeah, this is not an ETF that you want to hold for long term. It's just temporarily. And as you can see, you can make quite a bit of money off of this ETF. If you um, it's, it's just acting as a hedge, you know, your goal isn't to really make money off this. Um, we're really just hoping that the market doesn't crash as much as it does and if it does then our portfolios will be saved because we own this etf um and we'll see some nice gains just like right now um so of course you could do options as well buying calls and puts so the next method will for this example we'll use spy um sitting at we're pretty much at all-time highs as well um but if you have any stock or you just want to buy puts on the overall um, index um, just buy go ahead and buy some puts um, some shorter term expirations maybe like a week out two weeks out uh, the whole, whole goal here is to it's going to act as insurance so if the market does tank then your portfolio isn't going to tank as much just because you have a protective but uh, you could do this with the s p 500 index or any other stocks you own so for example if you own say facebook stock uh, go ahead and buy some puts on that if you think that a market correction is going to occur in the short term. And of course, if that correction does not occur, uh, you will lose money on those puts that you bought. But your overall portfolio will be saved just because you're holding um, bullish positions. And uh, overall, we just want the market to go up. But this is just an insurance policy, basically. So that's another method that you could do. And then the third Another method, third method, is just is just um, buying some value stocks. So stocks like Coca-Cola doesn't really move that much. Johnson & Johnson, Bank of America, pretty safe value stocks. And switching from growth to value stocks can really help your portfolio um, during periods of volatility because these stocks are going to attain its value, hence the name. Um, and the best thing about value stocks is they also pay out dividends. Most of them do. Um, so Coca-Cola, for example, pays out a 3.18% dividend uh, paid out quarterly. So you're able to collect some money um, every three months off of that. So that's pretty nice as well. So switching from growth, high, which is high risk, high reward, to value stocks, which is low risk, low reward, is a good play as well to do during times of uncertainty. And the and a fourth method is just to liquidate some of your positions. So just trim your positions. If you have a lot of money invested, you could just sell some of those positions, especially the losing ones, um, and just hold cash. Cash is king, and if the market continues to drop, you can eventually get back in at some cheaper prices, which is pretty sweet. Um, so that's another method you could do. Um, to protect your portfolios from a crash. Four easy methods. First one, buying the VXX. Um, buying calls on that would be pretty good as well. Second method, buying protective puts against your shares. Uh, and third, switching from growth to value stocks. And fourth, just trimming out your positions. So four easy methods for you guys. Uh, comment down below where your thoughts are. And of course, subscribe for me to the channel. Helps out a lot. Thanks for watching.